Hi guys, welcome to Chosen Explosions End Time Prophetic Revelations. I received a rather somber word from the Lord, um, <laughs> and right after the last word that was extremely encouraging. The title of this word is A Call to Wake Up Before It's Too Late. Um, and in this word, the Lord says, the good news is, is that it's not too late yet. And uh, we know that the Lord has a remnant that is fully awake and is about the Father's business uh, and that is ready and prepared to do any and everything that God has called them to do. And that's the people that the Lord was speaking to in the last word. But in this word, the Lord is speaking to those who are still asleep or partially still asleep. Um, sadly, unfortunately, we know that a large portion of the church is still asleep and, and we should be praying that they would fully wake up but anyway here is that word from the Lord it says awaken my people awaken can you not see that while you slumbered and slept your enemy has invaded your house you are fully surrounded and trampled within wipe the sleep from your eyes on your feet no time to waste arise for battle it's not too late can you see? Are your eyes opened yet? Your house has been plundered. It is left in shambles. All of this has happened as you have slumbered and slept. Are your eyes still cloudy? Are they opened yet? Awake, O sleeping ones, jump to your feet. Your children have been captured, carried away as prisoners of war. All while you slumbered and slept, jump to your feet. It's, it isn't too late. Lord, we just thank you, Father God, Lord, that you love us enough to encourage us, God, as you do all the time, Lord. But, Lord, you love us enough to rebuke us, Lord, as well. Lord, you love us enough to warn us. Lord, you love us enough to speak not only good words but hard words to us, Father. And, Lord, we just cry out to you right now, Lord. Father, we cry out to you for your children that's still asleep. And Lord, for those, the ones that their house has been plundered. Father God, that they would awaken before it's too late. And Lord, that they would come back to you, God. And they would repent, Father God, of their complacent ways, God. And Lord, that they would come into perfect alignment with you, Lord. Lord, so that you can heal their house, heal their children. And, Lord, we trust you, God. Lord, we trust you, Father God, Lord, that you're in control. Lord, that you're in control, Father God. And, Lord, I thank you for that, Lord. We know that you're doing a good work. Lord, you're doing a good work in our houses, in our children, Lord, in our families, in our ministries. And, Lord, we thank you for it. We love you for it. And for those, God, that are still suffering, Father, maybe they are fully awake. Maybe they've come back to you, Lord, but restoration has, is not complete, God. We lift those brothers and sisters up to you. And we speak restoration right now into their homes, into their children. We speak uh, restoration, resurrection life over their houses, over their family, over their children, Lord, over their finances, God, over their marriages, over their relationships, Lord, over everything that belongs to them, Lord, I know that you love them. And Lord, for those that have not awakened yet, Lord, Father God, Lord, we ask you, Father God, that Lord, that they be shaken out of their, their slumber before it's too late. And Lord, we just praise you for it. Lord, use us as a, as a trumpet. God, use us as your voice in the earth. And, Lord, we give you all the glory and all the honor and all the praise. Lord, bless my brothers and sisters. Lord, let your spirit be poured out upon them right now, Lord God. Father, I speak restoration. I speak healing in the mighty name of Jesus to every area of their life. Lord, we praise you for that. We thank you. You're a good God. You're a good God. Strengthen those that are weak. Strengthen those that are weak. Awaken those that are asleep. And Lord, we thank you for restoration for them. 
in every area. In Jesus' name, we love you so much. Amen. Amen. Well, guys, that's all I have for right now. God bless you. I love you. And we are praying for you. Bye-bye.